never show up in a meeting without knowing what is expected out of you. A lot of times we get invites and we just accept the invite and show up in the meeting without even reading the agenda, without even knowing what is expected out of us. Please don't do that. If you don't know why the meeting invite came to you, please ask the organizer, why have they invited you? What is expected out of you? That's one thing you should definitely do. Second thing, inside the meeting, if you have doubts, if you have questions, please ask those questions. Don't wait for anybody else to ask. You have to clarify all your doubts. Nobody else is going to do that. Third thing, if you don't have time, if you can't stretch beyond the stipulated time, please tell them five minutes before the time is going to end that I have another work to do. I have something else. I can't stretch beyond this time. Please block some other time for us to continue this discussion. Another important aspect is the minutes of the meeting. A lot of time, the meeting organizer does not send the minutes of the meeting, which is the set of points which were discussed in that particular call. If they are not sending it, what you can do is after the meeting is over, you can send one email to the organizer saying these are the points which were discussed and this is what I am going to do or this is the action item on me. So at least from your side, you will be clear or if the organizer is sending minutes of meeting, then you need to read it very carefully and understand what is the action on you. If you're not clear about the action mentioned in the email, please respond to that email and make sure that you are on the same page with respect to what is expected out of you. And lastly, it is also important for us to see and observe who is conducting how in that particular meeting discussion. Lot of people conduct themselves with lot of authority. They conduct themselves with lot of executive presence. The way they ask questions, the way they talk, it is something that we can learn as well. While we can't just copy their style, my only point is observe people who drive meetings very well, observe people who speak very well in meetings, and then try to learn from them by observation. It will help you improve prove yourself in the long run. All right, I hope this helps. Do let me know what you think about it in comments. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. If you found this useful, share with others. Take care and bye for now.